I'm Ina Fried with CNET News. I'm here in Whistler, Canada with Steve Messler, who's one of the pushers on USA One, the bobsled known as the Night Train. Um, obviously, you're here to win a medal and you know compete in bobsled, but one of the other things that you're doing is connecting with uh, schools back home. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, it's been amazing. Um, schools, back, <laughs> schools back home, schools from all over the country, uh, kids from the age of you know, first grade, you know, five, six years old, up to you know, not kids, up to you know, undergraduate and, and graduate level courses at the University of Florida, uh, my alma mater. And it's been great. We've been able to, to, to bring them together and have them enjoy the Olympic experience, not just for the two and a half weeks that is the Olympics, but to actually have them enjoy the, the buildup and then you know, hopefully afterwards enjoy the, you know, the, the bring down after the Olympics and show them that it's not just the two weeks and show them that it's, there's more to it than that. And also at the same time, bring them to places that they can't can't go. We're doing closed closed circuit things on Skype, where we're you know for 20 or 30 minute periods. I'm doing Q and A's with with these classrooms from the Olympic Village, uh, sitting there. It's something that when I was a kid, there was no way that that was possible. So, for me to be able to bring that to these kids and and have that you know come full circle to go from going to classrooms before speaking to speaking to kids and then now being able to have the technology to run it myself and have the you know have the platform right off my right off my MacBook and to be able to to give that experience to kids which is something that I would have loved to have is amazing it's so much fun you mentioned your MacBook uh, the pilot of uh, the night train is Steve Holcomb is a big PC guy Windows engineer you're kind of a Mac guy uh, any PC Mac conflict we, all there all the time all the time whenever anything if there's a, a tiny little thing that will that'll glitch on my MacBook he he's all over it because that's the you know, that's Max kind of claiming the fame is they don't have the, the, some of the issues that a PC has. So anytime anything, if anything ever goes wrong with my Mac, no matter how small, Hulky's all over it because he, he just he loves that little rivalry. And you're also kind of a gadget guy. You travel a lot on the road. What kinds of stuff do you carry with you? I've got everything from my BlackBerry Storm. Uh, I'm Verizon, so you know, unfortunately there is no iPhone. Uh, to my Bose headphones, to my MacBook Pro, uh, my PSP. All the things, all the things that you know, essential for being on the road for five months at a time. I haven't been home. It's it's February fifteenth, and I haven't been home since October tenth. Uh, so you need everything to keep you entertained. Obviously, you are here to uh, do some sledding. Uh, how's it been so far, and how's this track here? Uh, it's, we haven't got on the ice quite yet. We start in a couple of days. We're excited. It's been good. Uh, you know, Luge had a terrible tragedy a couple of days ago. We're we're still kind of reeling over that, but at the same time, we're hoping that that's not gonna affect us and we know it's not going to affect us it's it's just it's good to remember but at the same time we have to to, to be ready and understand we still have a job to do thanks steve thank you